hello you are welcome in this video i'll be showing you how to add admin to your facebook page and interestingly we are referring to your facebook page we are not referring to your personal account your personal account has your username and your password then i recommend do not give your username or password to people except on a very dear uh, case or cases uh, the major thing you want to give out is access to pages and that is what you can give out because with your personal account you can create multiple pages pages will now be for your business and you want people to undo or manage or help you create your content uh, to be scheduled or to be posted on your pages so then you can have them access the page uh, from facebook so how do you add people to your page now you see i said how do you are uh, how to add admin let me explain that administrative privileges is important and sensitive you don't want to give it to anybody and everybody so you want to consider what would be the functionality uh, or rule of the bearer before you can assign administrative privilege so the first thing is if you do not have your page you are currently using your personal account you can simply just log into facebook let me just go back to say facebook and on your Facebook account, which is your facebook.com, you can, you can instantly just click on this nine button of the menu. And you can see you are acting as Facebook Mojito on Facebook, this is the profile. So you can click on this nine button and on under this create, click on create. So you can start here by creating your page. So I'm going to do a video on that subsequently. Uh, if you are new to my channel, kindly hit the subscribe button, be a part of my community, share this content, like it. I say thank you as you do so. So the next thing is we have created the page and we want to assign administrative tasks to users, to people. So I'm going to click on this nine button being the first time and I will click on pages and you are going to see your pages. I can click on the page, which is Palladium Innovation. You will see that initially I am on this profile, which is my personal profile, but it is asking me for me to see more tools. And I'm actually coming to this professional dashboard. This is where I'm actually coming for me to switch from, uh, for me to add users to this page. I should and I must uh, be switching to the page officially and it means I cannot just con use this page as from my own personal user account. So the first thing I want to do and you should do is to make sure you switch to your page so that you can have the full features. So when you click on switch and it's saying switch to palladium innovation for more features tools and settings i say yes yeah, switch and that is now coming back to you see i'm now on palladium innovation and i'm not just on palladium innovation i am acting on that page so it is the page that i am having access to as the owner this is how you should assess your facebook page for your business so you can click on this uh, manage or just click on professional dashboard so if you click on professional dashboard you will just literally need to scroll down to page access so on your profile make sure that you are on your professional dashboard under your page then scroll down to page access so once you click on page access you can see though people with facebook access and we have people with stars access so people with facebook access are people that have administrative privileges you can click on add new and you should know 
that the person who has Facebook access can switch into the page, manage it directly on Facebook or by using other tools like Meta Business Suite, Creator Studio. Meaning that the person has access to switch to the page as a full uh, time role. Any action you take as this page, including when you check into a location would may be visible to anyone else who manages it. Anyone else with Facebook access will share the page experience, including news feed, notification, and for the page. So you can just click next and you can search the bearer via their email. So So when you enter into the name, you are going to see that Facebook will start giving you re recommendation. You can see suggestions of different uh, user accounts. User accounts. Make sure that the bearer you want to add to your page you know the user account and you can confirm that this is indeed the person i want to add so that you are not going to send a request to have authority on your page to somebody who truly doesn't know you and the person can even accept it and from there the person can literally just you know take it up so that is one and of course please note Anybody you've given the administrative access can create content, can manage your messages, can see your community activity, can run your ads, insights, or your page performance, and literally the person has full control. The person literally has full control, which includes that the person can delete the page, the person can even remove you. The person can remove anybody, including you, the owner and even delete the page so you don't want to give the administrative privilege to anybody anyhow you want to be rest assured that you are giving somebody or a team with the uh the expectation the responsibility that is assigned otherwise you want to perhaps look at people with tax access so these are people that you have given certain tax and they will only be eligible to doing the tax as recommended you can add and you see these people can literally cannot switch to the page they don't have the authority on the page they can only manage the page via third party solution like meta business suits creator studio and that is where they can create content manage so people with stars Task you can grant people the access to create content. People with tasks can do basic work from this platform. Of course, they can uh, create your content, they can schedule your content for Meta Business Suite, they can set up your business manager, set up your campaign, and they can do a lot of things also. But they cannot ask they cannot have access to your group and events they cannot have it because meta business suits does not have that functionality for now so it is important that you know who you are giving the access to and you know the access that you are giving to the uh, users so from there you just need to add the person by their email or their name and once they uh, accept, once you see the email, once you see the name, you need to enter your password and assign them with that task. And of course, if you want to remove anybody, you can just click on this icon and remove access or change access level. So that is 
the summary of how to add users to the page so if you have found some lessons uh, please hit the subscribe button be a part of the community uh, feel free to ask questions and you can dm me for uh, facebook adverts and uh, services thank you and god bless